Amy Smart defends husband amid allegations, this type of reporting needs to stop. Amy Smart is slamming the accusations that her husband Carter Ruisterhouse coerced a makeup artist to give him oral sex. Just two days ago, a woman named Kaylee Kaminsky came forward to allege HGTV's Carter Ruisterhouse, 41 forced her to perform a sex act on him in order to keep her job. Now, Carter's wife, Amy Smart, also 41, is stepping forward to not only defend her husband but blast the publication that first reported the accusations against him. When you are in a consensual relationship, then you need to take responsibility for engaging in that and not play victim. Amy captioned an image of herself with Carter and their daughter Flora. If a relationship does not work out the way you want it to, then sorry, but that is the risk you take when getting intimate with another person. There are plenty of relationships I wish I could go back and make different choices about, but it was on me to decide. We need to take responsibility and learn from our mistakes and choices. She went on to call out the original news outlet, The Hollywood Reporter, if not by name, for what she sees as irresponsible reporting. The article is very damaging and cruel to one of the most kindest, loving, non-aggressive men I have the privilege of knowing and I am so sorry for these salacious words being thrown around, they are extremely hurtful. This type of reporting needs to stop, it's so damaging for personal lives and careers and just not fair. Enough is enough, this is a plea to the writers, outlets and media. Head here to take a look back at Amy and Carter's marriage and photos. Gailey alleged in the aforementioned story that, while working on Carter's reality show Carter can 10 years ago, he frequently requested oral sex from her. She says she attempted to laugh it off. Finally one day, while driving to a project site with her, he pulled off the road and allegedly asked her, Do you enjoy your job? I said I did and in fact would like to work more, handling more of his personal appearances outside the show. He said, Well, I can help you with that. But you need to do something for me. Fearing losing her job, Kaylee claims to have agreed to his requests for sexual favors 10 to 15 times afterward. Thus far, none of Kaylee's allegations have been substantiated. We are in a climate right now where it's so wonderful and needed to have women coming forward to break their silence, it is vital and important for female equality. Period. A lot of the stories are horrific and need to be brought to light. This story, about my husband, Carter Ruisterhouse, on the other hand, is now taking it too far and boundaries are being crossed. When you are in a consensual relationship, then you need to take responsibility for engaging in that and not play victim. If a relationship does not work out the way you want it to, then sorry, but that is the risk you take when getting intimate with another person. There are plenty of relationships I wish I could go back and make different choices about, but it was on me to decide. We need to take responsibility and learn from our mistakes and choices. Women are powerful and we need to be reminded of the strength and power we hold and learn ways to take care of ourselves so we don't find ourselves saying yes when we really need to say no. The article is very damaging and cruel to one of the most kindest, loving, non-aggressive men I have the privilege of knowing and I am so sorry for these salacious words being thrown around, they are extremely hurtful. This type of reporting needs to stop, 
It's so damaging for personal lives and careers and just not fair. Enough is enough, this is a plea to the writers, outlets and media and more due diligence needs to be done before crafting headlines and stories. Have discernment when you tell a story and please consider the source and story before just printing anything to get readers and viewers. Hash love et cetera.